Okay, let's go to our introduction. How we can begin with AutoCAD? First of all, we use the last uh, version, uh, before the last version, 2020 uh, of AutoCAD. It's very uh, good uh, version. So let's open our software, Auto. This is the uh, before last version, Autodesk AutoCAD 2020. So when uh, when open the AutoCAD software, we will have this home page. Uh, uh, this home page. So we can to open a new file. We go here to start drawing. We we begin. We click here. First of all, we have this page. We can show here the AutoCAD uh, divide. We can show here the uh, as access or, or grids and the home page and the page of working and AutoCAD. If we go to the cursor of the mouse and do zoom or minus or plus zoom, we can show in details the uh, home page of the software. Here we have the access XY, the, or the AutoCAD is a coordinate software. So we have here, if we go to, we show here, we are for example here and uh, this number of coordinate okay we can show after how we can draw with the coordinate uh, and uh, if you need we can you can for example go to here to the o snap uh, okay the, the here the o snap windows here taskbar here do we have the the snap task the snap uh, bar here this are we can show many important options to do in this bar, okay? So if we click here, display drawing grid, we can uh, di di disappear the grid. Here, I prefer to do this to uh, be, uh, to make our work more clear, okay? We can, uh, so disappear this grid. Also, you must know uh, this, uh, uh, software the AutoCAD software is un unless unit uh, unitless software so if for example if we draw any shape here or any drawing is a unitless uh, uh, drawing okay so if we put for example 10 here 10 a lens or area or any dimension is a unitless it's not a meter or millimeter it's only a scaled drawing will be a scaled room but if we need to export th this drawing to any other software we can precise the unit to be uh, with uh, exact distance and the other software so how we can do it uh, this uh, introduction is uh, this uh, uh, introduction and uh, and we learn from this introduction how we can begin with the software so first of all we, we, if we need to display or disappear the grid we can go to here okay then for the units if we need to export the drawing after we can go to autocad here options okay sorry to here drawing utilities okay we can go to units here so we can choose our unit that we want to export miles millimeter centimeter meter or any other okay here the lens, how we can, the decimal, uh, okay, architecture, what we, we need, okay, and the precision of the dimension, if we need to precise the dimension. So let's uh, click cancel, okay, this is uh, all, uh, an introduction about the grid view or the units using in this software. Also now we need, uh, after in this introduction, to click, right click, go to option, you can here before begin to drawing and use AutoCAD, make your specify uh, or private option. For example, for the file here display, uh, you can uh, the crosshair size, you can increase the crosshair size, for example. Okay. You can show that the crosshair be large. Okay. Let's go to option and return. It and we press apply 
okay and you can change all this uh, uh, options here you can try and let's go to open and save first of all it's very important thing uh, the automatic save when you are made the power uh, uh, may you lost the power uh, suddenly so you must uh, make the autocad do automatic save you can precise the time uh, for example you put every five minutes between save it automatic save so the autocad every five minutes do an automatic save okay also if you uh, if you hear an important other important thing if you if, if you use for example a very uh, advanced version 2020 for example and you need to send your file to other uh, your to your friend uh, and your friend use an old version of autocad so uh, the file can't open and with your friend so you must uh, save your file automatically do uh, make the software save uh, the uh, file automatically as an old version of AutoCAD. So you must put here old version like 2000, 2007, 2010, 2004. So here I put 2013. Okay. Also, for example, and display for the colors, you can make the colors white, for example. Let's put apply. So you can make it uh, white, but I prefer to use the black color okay and here other or oh, many advanced option you can uh, here also for the uh, the here the for the erase here okay the size of the eraser when you want to erase the drawing you can increase the eraser or here the selection okay you can increase also the size of the grip size okay this is the grip size is for the selection for example if we do any drawing you can increase this grip size here and blue okay so what we have also uh, here how we began with the autocad we can show we click here on start the drawing option before drawing we can show change the color of the display we can set our specify uh, size of the cursor of the cell uh, eraser on other anything uh, also we can uh, put the auto save time how we select with autocad erase snap midpoint and it will show three four five now point okay for example if we have any drawing to uh, if we need to delete the drawing or erase some part of a drawing we click with we, we use the eraser so we click on on the keyboard on the e later e bottom erase okay so we can delete this press enter also uh, we press enter so if we press enter uh, uh, another uh, another uh, so if we repress the enter we can go with the last comment that we use so here we can delete or we can select all the drawing and press delete on the keyboard okay so let's return if we have a drawing we can for example let's for uh, we can for example delete a part of the drawing or we can select all the drawing and delete it let's now also draw another drawing you must know for example if you have a drawing how we can select an AutoCAD if we can go from the left okay uh, to the right you can press one press on the left mouse press button okay one press and we go from the left to the right okay so all the object all the object included in this rectangle okay uh, will be selected for example this object this line from here to here all the all this line is included in the rectangle so this line will be selected but this line from here to here okay from this point to this point this line a part of this line is in the rectangle so this line this line here will not be selected okay so this line because this line all this line is in the rectangle 
is selected now, but this line from this point to this point is not all this line and the rectangle, so in not, it's not selected now. Okay, but if you, we press uh, on the uh, left uh, bottom of the mouse and go from right to the left, so each object is uh, intersect uh, intersect with this rectangle will be selected. Okay, so this line and this line because it, uh, we have intersection between this, uh, this line and the rectangle and this line of the, and the rectangle of selection, so these two lines are selected now. Okay, so we can select like this all the object, or we can go for example selected this like this and like this. So so we learn now how we can select arrays, do the option, how we can begin with AutoCAD. Now we will, we will, we want to show the snaps, the last thing and the introduction, the snap snaps and AutoCAD. For example, if we draw a line here like this. Okay, we want to go and show uh, the midpoint or the beginning on the, or the end of this line. Okay, how we can do this? If we go to here, if we go to here, to this option, show snapping reference line and right click object snap. Uh, tracking uh, setting we can show that the AutoCAD give us the endpoint midpoint center the node uh, the tangent the nearest okay the intersection the extension the parallel all the snap we can show them in AutoCAD for example if we want to get the midpoint of this line we can go to here so the AutoCAD give as the midpoint okay we can show here midpoint so we have the midpoint for example here we have endpoint here we have endpoint also okay so here we have endpoint okay so here we can show here the snap of uh, uh, AutoCAD. So also for example if we go from this point we can show perpendicular snap here okay and here also we can show the this uh, which call here or uh, O snap or O tracking or dynamic import or orthogonal we can use uh, we will show this option after in the next lecture so let's go let's return to the introduction we have these five points we learn them an introduction this is an a small introduction with AutoCAD we will show we will begin with drawing and learn the comments most important comments on AutoCAD and the next lecture thank you for listening we will continue on the next lecture